This just in, the supervolcano Yellowstone Caldera has, is showing signs that it will erupt. Although it hasn't erupted for 600,000 years, the buildup of magma has finally become too much pressure for the volcano to hold. Lava has started to come from the side vents, and any minute now the magma will come out the central vent, causing a catastrophic explosion of ash into the air. Volcanoes usually occur along tectonic plates, but can also occur elsewhere. They can occur in just about any ecosystem, but are most common along the ocean. Most volcanoes show up in the Pacific Ocean what it, in what is known as the Ring of Fire. There are 452 volcanoes in the Pacific Ring of Fire, and that holds about 75% of the world's active volcanoes. Plants are the most affected by volcanoes, but when everything cools down, they grow back quickly since the soil of the volcano is rich. Volcanoes aren't bound to one ecosystem. They're bound to many ecosystems. Volcanoes can rehabilitate ecosystems. Mammals and aquatic life are the most affected animals in this area because mammals would die in the lava and wouldn't be able to breathe from the ash. For aquatic life, many would die from the change of temperature or the change in food supply. People in the immediate vicinity will die from the volcano instantly. Build a emergency supply kit full, filled with non-perishable food, face masks to protect you from the ash, and non-perishable water. To protect yourself from volcanic ash from an eruptive volcano, you should put a damp washcloth over your arm or your sleeve from a jacket over your mouth. A volcanic eruption, follow the evacuation drill and help out any neighbors that require assistance. Stay safe because remember, I love you.